Charlie, nice to have you on the program. What's up? Hey, how's it going, Rome? Charlie, listen, first things first, KB told me he was chatting you up, and you let loose with a few F-bombs, so I'm going to have to ask you to keep it clean, all right? No, yeah, yeah, it's all good, brother. It's all good. All right, so listen, you're a former Navy SEAL. When did you get into jousting? How did you get into jousting? Uh, you know what? First of all, I clear up the former Navy SEAL. I worked with the Navy SEALs with EOD, and that got put on the, the piece as a former Navy SEAL, so I can just end that right there. And got it. As far as getting into working with uh, jousting, training horses, had a bunch of horses trained up, had one of the medieval time style jousting troops come through town, said, hey, wow, love watching you ride. You, you look like a knight. Let's take you out and do some shows. Went and did it. Wasn't really into it. Didn't like the whole medieval, you know, medieval time style theme shows, Renaissance Fair jousting. So got together with some guys, uh, Cliff, Cliff uh, Bassett, Shane Adams, that did the Realgus deck, full contact jousting like we do now. We kind of refined it, got hurt a lot till we figured it out. Now injuries are pretty minimum, but uh, it is definitely the medieval demolition derby. It's like two trains colliding on the train track, and we're trying to market that as the sport and break away from all the stigmas of medieval times and re- Renaissance fair. Hey, Charlie, so you mean, you mean less yeah. moat smack and less catapult smack and more full impact hype? You got it, brother. When the lances drop, the BS stops, and that's what we want. And I've got some, some MMA fighters that have jumped on board, Jake the Snake Paul, Brandon Melendez. Uh, you might have seen them on Ultimate Fighter. Hey, Charlie, do those guys actually, I mean, do they like what you do, or do you have them on a horse, and if they dehorsed other guys? I mean, are they into it? Do they do it? You know what? They're here right now in Austin at a rookie training camp. We got them out, like you asked, their combines training camps. Hell yeah, there is. Are you kidding? There really are. I just said that. I said that rhetorically. Are there really combine camps? That's what we got going on here right now to launch the sport. Uh, once we had the capital come in, we could put money into paying guys to actually be here. They're in training camp, running with their armor, uh, getting used to riding the horses. That's the hardest part. You got race horses, right, Rome? The hardest part is for the jockey to get them around the track. Like that's the thing with my knights. What all I got to do? Yeah, is but you know what? Those cats. The, and if I respect those guys, and they're strong, but they're not with lances and armor. That that's not full impact per se. Hey, Charlie, what's it feel like to dehorse a guy? Oh, it's the greatest feeling in the world. It's got to be what, what Ray Lewis feels like when he just smokes someone coming over the middle. It's like you come down, it's the biggest hit ever. You feel it through every fiber of your being. And then when you hit the end and you see the look on the squire's face, you know he's, he's taking a soil sample. You spin around, you look at him down, and you are it, it's like the biggest high you've ever felt. Charlie, what's it like when you're on the other side of that? You know what? You slam into the ground, you do a quick mental check, you do a nut check, you get up, you get back on your horse, and you go lay him out. That's what it feels like for me. Now, the rest of them, I don't know. You see a bright light, you have tea with Jesus, and then you get back on your horse. Bro, you're not playing. No. This is the real deal. We will sell out arenas before I am done building this sport. I have Gabe Giordano as my partner. We are going to pioneer full contact jousting, bring it back from centuries ago, as you mentioned, We've got the uh, creator of the Iron Man suit that's trying to come up with uh, a kind of a composite hybrid suit so there could be more people involved. Charlie, in talk, it. Charlie, I got about 30. Give me the end play. What's the end game here? Are we talking stadiums, arenas? Where do you put this thing? Stadiums, brother. Stadiums. It'll be just like the gladiator pits, just like the, the Romans would go and watch the gladiators fight. That's what we're going to bring back. You're going to have knights in there crushing each other once I get big, strong, professional athletes doing this. I. So, Charles, I'll tell you what, man, you got my attention. You got my attention. Sir Charles of St. Andrews. Hey, Charlie, good luck with it. All right, good rapping with you. He's not messing around at all. Huge call brought to you by 5-Hour Energy. 5-Hour Energy, hours of energy right now. No crash later on. Go to 5-HourEnergy.com.